Okay, so hi, this is Roslyn and my husband, Marcus. So today is January 12, 2020, and um, this morning, uh, the two guys that I believe stole our car, uh, they struck again. Um, we didn't touch our car, well, they did touch our car, but they didn't uh, get inside because the car was locked. But they did get a neighbor's car. Um, as far as I know, um, there was, a, I believe, a purse that was inside that was visible. And uh, so they were able to uh, enter the car through some means. I don't, I don't know if they broke any windshields or anything like that, but I think there was a door on the passenger side that doesn't lock. Yeah, so I already saw their car and they did not break anything. So I talked to the lady and then the lady said she locked the car, but her car has a, on the passenger side, when you, when you use the remote to lock the car, that passenger side didn't lock so they did a manual lock for that and then she said um yeah she she locked the car and then i heard her screaming outside so i said oh my god something happens again so i check our cctv and i capture it there is a two guy i will include the clip the clip for that so guys beware and if you can help us you know because if you can watch the cctv and you can do like uh, zoom in and then if you know someone in the authority who can help us to find those two thieves because we don't know if that two is the same who stole our car but it looks like right i think so yeah if you were to watch our video of where our car got stolen and then these guys they look like they're wearing pretty much the same clothing uh even down to the white shoes so um yeah definitely anybody that can you know i guess Take a look at the footage, and if you can make a distinction or if you have any information, you know, definitely contact uh, the local authorities. And, and we live in Atlanta. You can do that. You yeah, know? definitely. Or comment on my An video. An anonymous uh, tip would definitely be appreciated because we definitely need to catch these guys. Um, you know, I, when it happened to us on New Year's Eve, you know, I believe they were possibly, I don't know if they're like old enough to go to school or, you know, young enough to still be in school, but they you know school was definitely out during that time when our car got stolen and now today it's the weekend so i'm thinking these guys are just you know pulling this stuff because you know they don't have school or whatever but um yeah just be extra vigilant you know make sure your cars are always locked make sure you don't keep any valuable things in your car um you know that's you know that's a lesson and um you know if you see something you know do something say something you know because it can help the next person down the line yes and also even you know that you lock your car using your remote just make sure to check those all the doors if it is totally locked you know and then just like my husband said don't leave variable things and then these two thieves i'm not pretty sure because the other guy went downstairs in our building so i'm not, i really hope that they don't live in the same building where we live you know yeah. but yeah please there, there is a there is a back entrance to our um not back entrance but you know there's a back walkway, walkway around our building so possibly that was kind of like you know their escape plan you know to go downstairs and then go out the back or whatever but oh, um man. you know hopefully hopefully you know we can catch these guys or you know the police can catch these guys but yeah if you guys know anything please uh, you know comment or notify the authorities yeah and if you can share this video and then you can share my other video when they stole our car please please do share our video so it will spread yeah not happen to anybody else yes okay so check this video clip